everyone. Welcome to my channel. This is Lava. Good to see everybody. And welcome the guests of my channel as well. If you're new, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. All right, my wonderful collectives, let's take a look. What messages I have for you? What messages do I have for you? For my collectives. I have receipts, proof and receipts and revenge. I feel like you're going to have, you are either having or about to have a proof of some sort of revenge. Um, this situation could be dragging from a deep past or whatever that situation you're going through. But I feel like the proof is here. You have the proof or something is about to be proven. Proven beyond reasonable doubt, okay? Some sort of actions uh, of some individual. Of course, I will take a look further into this situation to know for sure what kind of receipts, what kind of proof. But I feel like you are about to prove your case. You are going to have a hard evidence against an individual or group of individuals. They're showing me female here. Some sort of female... This is, could be a group of people that um, currently she's very worried, or they, okay? Scared, they're panicking, they're in anxiety because there is proof. Proof. You're going to prove your case. You're going to prove that, yes, indeed, this revenge, this punishment, this payback has been taking place against you. So let's take a look. What kind of proof is it and what is it in regards of... Something here is coming to light heavily and often by the receipts, meaning it's a hard evidence. It's traceable. Okay. If it's traceable, it's producible. And if it's producible, it's indeed are going to be used against your karmics, your enemies, your foes that relentlessly try to destroy your life in the court of law. So there's going to be some sort of evidence. I have dirty games here. Dirty game. I have boss. This is, could be somebody's boss. I have corruption. I also have intuition and ending. See? Intuition and ending. So your intuition was point on. You might have solved this um, case relying on your intuition, okay? Or um, you, you listen to your intuition. And you're like, yeah, that's right. That's right. This actually, this actually is the case. So you're calling it out. You have been maybe potentially gathering evidence for a very long time, but there was a dirty game played against you, and there was a corruption. Corruption with somebody who is either a boss or somebody who was in a position of authority. Some sort of corruption here is coming to light. You will be able to prove this corruption, which is, by the way, is ending. So expect ending of this corruption and all of these dirty games. See, so have fear, worry, and panic. Somebody's boss here. I have tradition inheritance as well. Maybe for some it will resonate. But I do have that whoever did this game, this corruption, maybe in a position of authority, maybe it's an individual, but it's still showing me some sort of influential person. They're scared. They're scared, they're worried. Worried why? Because there is a strong heart, irrevocable, material evidence against this crook. So they're scared. She or they, whoever they are. What is the situation? What is the situation in regards of this corruption? What happened here? Work. War corruption. I feel like this person, whoever this boss, whoever this person is, I don't see if this is a female or a male. She's going to be booted. She's gone. She doesn't want to go. And I feel like she or they, whoever they are, they do not want to leave. Leave their positions of authority. Leave their job. But I feel like by eight of 
eight of cups that are going to be booted and major changes coming up here in the next eight to eight days to eight weeks at the most eight months but i feel it like it's going to come in very heavily soon that whoever this crook is who has been participating in this corruption bribery was participating in this punishment against you, against you they they will literally going to be noticed uh, either arrested or they will be told hey you got you got to leave you got to leave because we have evidence against this corruption right receipts eight of pentacles so something here was done um during one's course of employment this individual could be in a position of authority but whoever this person is this boss somebody's boss play dirty games abuse their power and authority so whether they want it or don't want it there's an ending for them clarified eight of pentacles what kind of corruption are we talking about what is this type of corruption? What kind of corruption are we talking about? Gossip about you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Gossip about you. This is how they get busted. They're going to get get busted. She or they. Like I said, I, I don't really necessarily see currently at the moment who it is. Even though I pick up the energy of a feminine. Female most likely here. Who has been caught gossiping about you, slandering about you, caught ran handed talking shit about you, gossiping about you, meaning if you are in a position of authority, what business do you have gossiping about this person, which you, which is you, my collectives? So there's dots that I feel like that's going to be aligned and this person is caught already whoever that is so whoever that is i feel like losing their job they're finished this is at least what is going to happen so you already will see the changes because i feel like the universe removing this person this crook from her power and what does it mean if we're talking about the corrupt judge uh, or a corrupt cop or a corrupt politician, they will no longer have that privilege. They will no longer have access to gossip about you and paying out money to other officers to cause you harm, checking up on you, you know, interfering upon your, for example, electronic devices, whatever the case may be. So this crook, this boss is gone and they're caught. They're caught gossiping about you okay maybe somebody overheard them or her talking shit about you maybe this individual been caught participating like i said in this corruption i do have a phone here so something to do with wires and electronic devices okay so i feel like the evidence came through electronic device so if this crew who is in a position of authority most likely has been investigated okay she's been caught or he through uh wiretap and something here was picked up once again using this electronic device this is what i heavily heavily get gossiping about you so some sort of corrupt crook boss for some Maybe let's say if this is a commander of some sort of detachment or attorney general or whatever the case may be, and the officers investigating this person who supposedly their boss, right? Because we see boss, whoever these soldiers or officers investigating this crook, they consider this person a boss. And bam, <laughs> they're like, yeah, sh she's crook. She's corrupt. We intercepted this communication with so and so and so. And yeah, she, I'm assuming she or whoever that is, I'll take a look, uh, was gossiping about you. So red handed, receipt, red flags, okay? And whoever was investigating this person, this corrupt boss, she is the boss to these officers. Does that make sense? Look at that evidence. 
They got evidence. She's busted. She's gone. Evidence and there's a water sign here. An air sign. I have water sign and air. I have air sign and best friends. So, so they got the evidence where she was talking to her best friend or somehow the intercepted communication was between a water sign and an air sign and they're best friends. But I don't think they... So the picture what I get that this was an abuse of power and authority during the course of employment and there's a water sign and air sign connected and they're best friends. So they read the whole conversation. They could have read it or, or like wiretap it, uh, listen to what the message was saying, what, what these two best friends were talking to each other. But there was a communication between a water sign and air sign. Okay? And they're like, yeah, we got you. We got you. So they got it on record where these corrupt best friends, because it looks like it's multiple people here connected, so they wiretapped this conversation and they overheard the conversation between these best friends gossiping about you. Now, why are they gossiping about you, right? Now we have circumstantial evidence and a direct evidence where they specifically were talking about you. And these officers that appo were appointed to investigate this corruption, they thought of this person as a boss. You know what I mean? So, therefore, there's going to be a decision here made by higher-ups to get these be best friends out. Tell me more about this gossip. What are they gossiping? What were they gossiping about? See, Three of Pentacles. Some, they were talking about some sort of plan. Work plan. You know, how, who else are they going to involve... I have six of cups. It's about, can I trust you? Oh, okay, well, what do you think? Yada, 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 right? So so they were like looking for allies. Who can help them? What can they do, right? So they pretty much pinpoint <laughs> their own officers to who they are. So it's all done on the, on the phone. All done on the phone. What else they were gossiping about you? What else they were talking about? Six of ones. Six of ones. Yeah, they're like, no, she cannot win. Or he cannot win. Right? So they were pretty much talking about, you know, that we, we, we have to do something. Um, this is cannot get out of the hand. Who am I going to bribe next? Who am I going to pay next? What am I supposed to do? Because if this is continues on any longer, we're busted. Right? So they were talking about this air, water sign and air sign, this communication between them, who are best friends, by the way. Right? They're, they're all kooks. And they were saying, like, yeah, he or she, my collectives, are going to gonna win, pretty much, which you are, because this is ending. This is ending, but they're busted. They're busted. They, they, they want, they wanted to involve more people, I feel like, who would delay and prevent some sort of victory on truth coming forth. But like I said, this is out of their control. This is out of their control. Tell me more, clarified, what is this victory? What is this Knight of Swords? Something like we got to do it fast, okay? We, we got to do it fast because if we don't, we're already exposed. So on and so on and so on, okay? Clarified six of ones. Unknown. See, unknown. They don't know. I feel like they don't know. At this point, they don't know what to do. So they, they were contemplating. They were looking at their options what they should do because i feel like some sort of truths are coming out what is that truth is coming out they're very very scared here they were worried they're scared so the conversation that these friends had is that they were worried worried that they are being exposed and what they should do about it and i feel like these soldiers or these officers 
that has been observing and watching these crooks, because I feel like this has been going on for quite a while, they got the evidence. They got the evidence. Tell me more. Yeah, see, four of cups, they're sinking. And again, knight of swords. Revenge sinking. We got to do it fast. We got to do it fast. Um, I pick up this feeling like time. We got no time. We got to do it fast. You know, what are we going to do? What are we going to do? This big panic that their own corruption and dirty games is being exposed. They're freaking out. So there's a conversation between two best friends crooks. Water sign and air sign. So they're, they're caught. So tell me, who is, uh, who is this boss? What is this boss about in corruption and these dirty games? <clears throat> we have father. Somebody's maybe father involved here. And online. Communicating online. Maybe some of them is a father. Somebody's father. Doesn't have to be. But I have father here. Can my father do something? I also have earth sign flip over. So there could be, and again, friends. Father, friends, father's friends. Can father's friends do something? Revenge. Can there should be a revenge? Something about DSM-5. Okay, can we, can we turn out you, my collectives, and, and make them... Uh, you know, um, look crazy by DSM-5 or whatever the case may be. Who who else could jump in and uh, discredit, discredit you, my collectives, as a victim of abuse and torture and this dirty, sick game of this corrupt manics? They showed me three people here. Um... And like I said, they're all friends, right? Who can help? Who can help? Does the father know somebody, maybe? Some sort of earth sign, right? So revenge, they want revenge. It was initially all done because of their revenge, right? But this is, this is out. Secret's out. So I'm telling you, whoever they sing, see judgment coming up here. Judgment and king of pentacles, earth sign materialistic some sort of materialistic person money loves money was looking for long term under karma under judgment greedy all about money greedy they don't want to lose their jobs they don't want to lose their positions of authority they enjoy there's this air sign female here also queen of swords They don't want to lose their job. Fire sign here. King of Wands. Doesn't have to be necessarily fire sign. So I feel like they're all greedy here. They don't want to lose their jobs. What are they so concerned about? They're already busted here. What else are they so concerned about? Protection. Protection. Surprise. Burden and debt. North. They want some sort of protection. Or they've been potentially asking for protection. I need a protection. I need some sort of guarantee. Am I protected? What's going to happen to me? Something relevant in this nature. They don't want to be held accountable for what they did. So they want protection. And I also have burdens. I have debt. And I have North. North. Okay, so I don't know what North. Maybe they're trying to seek protection against someone from the North. So they very well know what's going on here. That's what they're calling. But like I said, this is ending here. See, transformation. It's ending. Karma. Judgment and judgment twice. Karma, five of swords. They're finished. Um, I feel like the evidence here that has been collected against this corrupt organization has been collected for, uh, 
you know, a long period of time. There is a time here, seven. Uh, Knight of Pentacles, it's about a long extended period of time. So, but, but whatever this recent evidence that has been obtained today, yesterday, uh, happened recently, is very strong. It leaves no doubt, no doubt that these attempts of faking uh, your mental state, entrapping you, forging evidence, setting you up, seeking revenge against you, this is all out, right? It's become very obvious. So in a way, it's kind of like a shocking and a surprise to, I feel, those who actually witnessing these uh, sick, twisted, corrupt, dirty games that has been taking place. But by judgment and five of swords, this is, um, it, it's finished. There's nothing could be done here. Clarify the judgment and five of swords. Magician, queen of pentacles, justice. Judgment. This materialistic female here, delusional, delusional manipulator, delusional manipulator will be judged. So, sounds to me like a female here. Female. Initially that did this. The organizer, I should say. It's, it's pretty much done. It's judgment. It's judgment upon this corrupt community. It's all revealed. All revealed. Yeah. And I'm, I'm talking about recently here. So hard evidence here. And, and someone here who is a crook here, these best friends, the circle of best friends, they are busted. Busted because it's all wiretapped. Wiretapped that they were trying to, they pretty much exposed everything. Everything, but recently it, it it become clearly clearly evident. So they know they're scared. They know. Now I feel like this fall is going to be very crucial for you and very important because I do have an ending, an ending of this corrupt situation, an ending. Let's clarify the ending. What's ending for you? The situation where you look for answers, when you try to figure out, when you try to find answers, it was a long period of, of searching, searching the truth, trying potentially to prove your truth, to prove what happened to you. I do see around you a fire, spate your wands, night of wands. Regardless that you have been going through this difficult um corruption that was unfortunately taking place in your life you i see so much movement so much fire here you do not allow yourself to be sad you still continue on there's achievements here i have full cars new beginnings wish fulfillment see everything you've been through i feel like you de you were destined to go through it because by strength card you become so strong and that pass, that pass, pass of pain, of searching, of fighting, of standing up for yourself, is actually the path that will lead you towards your wish fulfillment. That's exactly what it shows here. You overcome this darkness and you truly learn how to shine in a darkness. You become your own star. Because by um, a hermit, a hermit walking alone in the darkness, and the only thing that hermit holds in his lamp is a star. You never lost that guiding star within yourself. You only become brighter, stronger, smarter. You gain tremendous strength dealing with this corrupt manics.
truly. So, of course, there is an ending of this situation that I described earlier in this reading and moving towards the true wish fulfillment. It's a strong new beginning, strong, powerful new beginning here for you. Powerful new beginning. What else? I have Uras. It's once again physical strength and speed. Untamed potential. It's a time of great energy and health, freedom, action, courage, strength, understanding, and wisdom. You gain tremendous wisdom and strength. And that is something that no one will take away from you. No one. Nobody. And looking at your future, after this shenanigans is ending, and it's ending, your path, it's almost like you obtain that armor of a fighter and a soldier that nothing, nothing could defeat you. No one can defeat you. No one and nothing can break you. If this corrupt manix couldn't break you, no one will break you. So I want you to feel right now the power that is within your soul. And the power within your heart. Can anybody take that away from you? No. No. Every single time, over and over again, you're going to show your karmics. These crooks, psychopathic crooks, how strong you are. They know it. They're freaking out. They're freaking out and there is nothing they can do. Nothing. You pretty much told them, listen, I am in charge of my own life. I am in charge of my own destiny. My destined path is between me and my creator. You accepted the will of God. And that was the bestest decision you could have ever made. You believed the process. You believed in yourself. You believed your journey. And look who you become. Strong, powerful, incredible, unbreakable, unique, intelligent, and wise person. So your life changing here. Your life changing. You deserve your wish. Stars about wish fulfillment. You deserve that wish. And you're going to get that wish. What is that wish? What else is coming towards you? I have superficial, north, soul journey, mm -hmm. future. Mm -hmm. North, north and star, direction. You learn the difference, the important, the important lesson you have driven. From this difficult, painful journey of your soul. Is that you learn how to tell the difference between fake, superficial people. And trust it, the higher power. And trust it within yourself. That's the greatest lesson you have observed. You learned that at the end of the day. It is you and God. That's it. You learn how to rely on yourself. Very valuable lesson, lesson you have learned here about some sort of super, superficial, fake, shallow people, corrupt. Clarified superficial. Because I feel like before when you try to help people, you always, I feel like, get trapped, right? Failure to give oneself, sacrificed. You, I feel like in your past, you have sacrificed yourself too much for other people who didn't deserve that. 
you paid your sacrifice. This is, will never happen again. You understand? So you learn no more. No more shall, uh, shall I invest in a situation and in people. Waste my time upon miserable individuals who is not worthy of my time. Who only take an advantage of you. Greedy people. You learn tremendously. This is once again what made you strong. See, truth, ace of swords, you learn how to fight. You learn how to be a fighter. You not will ever going to be a victim. Ever. Unless it's so willing by God himself. So once again, logic, power. I feel like you can see right through everybody. You know who's who. It was a heavy lesson. It was a painful lesson. But you got A plus on that hard lesson. Now, anybody even dared, anybody even dared to take advantage of you, blocked your inspiration, tried to mess with you, tried to cause you harm. You got that sword. You can see clearly who's who. You can see clearly the situation. You're going to fight. And taken into consideration here by both runes and a tarot that you are strong, it's best not to fight with you because your enemies are destined to fail. One or one thousand of them. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. You are unbreakable. And that is the lesson of your soul journey. That is the lesson of your soul journey. King of Swords. Malice. Ruthless. Manipulator. Corrupt. Some female. All these people. All these people that you have. That have been doing this harm to you. You truly face the psychopaths. The worst psychopaths you could ever face. And you defeated this psychopath. They shown me some individual here who is plotted against you. This malice, manipulator, ruthless, mean tyrant. Psychopath. And some other female, moody, codependent, weak. You defeated these losers. And once again, you prove them who's who. Because they're finished. What else can you tell me about these losers here? Superficial, materialistic tyrants. That are being busted already. Already busted. I have father again coming up here. Lover's triangle. I don't even got to go into it. And I have justice. Government official. Some sort of judicial government official that fucked with you. Who thought that they're powerful than you. Thought that they're more powerful than you. They don't know what the fuck power is. Until they see you. They're not powerful. Because the true power. Does not come from your status. Nor your privilege. The true power. Comes from within. And that's exactly what you have learned. I feel like whoever these people are, powerful, non-powerful, privileged, government official, judicial officials, politicians, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. You can never be broken. And you will never be broken. And that exactly was your sole purpose. That potentially started sometimes in summertime. Okay. Let's take a look what other messages I have for you. What other important messages do I have? 
for you, my wonderful collectives. Community. House. Taylor Labor. Official person. Court. Thoughts. Unexpected income. Lovers. Jail. <laughs> this official person, whoever this tyrant, this sick manic tyrant or tyrants as a plural. Corrupt, sick tyrants that played sick games. They're going to prison. They're showing me some lovers here. This could be some sort of sick, twisted lover's triangle. I'm not going to get into it today. The main message from today's reading is for you to understand that this is almost over, number one. And hopefully I was able to guide you of what was the true purpose of this difficult, painful journey for you and your soul and your spiritual growth. So not that this corrupt official are going to jail. This is they showed me some lovebirds, see imprisonment, lovebirds, manipulated community, puffing, huffing. I have prosperity here, travel, uh, new direction, letting go of the past. See, this is this is all this new beginning. You're leaving the past behind. Black magic backfired, and I have victory. You are victorious. You won. You won. You won against all odds that this so-called powerful, privileged, corrupt organization have bat against you. You defeated all odds in the most incredible and unique ways. Nobody expected this. But you showed everybody otherwise. So know that the victory is coming towards you. Everything has been broken. Whatever has been done here against you in the past stands no chance. No chance. It's finished. I also have here travel. I have new new directions. You're going to take some sort of new direction. There could be an increase of your finances here as well by prosperity. So things are, things are actually going to go your way. I feel like the universe are going to start giving you this incredible blessings and surprises just a, just these incredible unique surprises for everything you've been through for your bravery for your strength you deserved it i also feel like moving down the road you're going to look at this whole situation with these corrupt manics and you're truly going to to say to yourself i cannot really believe how incredible the higher power truly is. How wise and strong I actually become. Because I do have here that you're going to let go of this past. I know it may be difficult right now, but you're going to let it go. Clarify travel and new direction. What is this about? Ten, ten of pentacles. It's, it's a new beginning. New beginning. This is, could be money, wealth. Financial increase, stability, business, family, new circle of friends, job, status, prosperity. That's what Ten of Pentacles is. It's a prosperity. It's money. It's wealth. See, past, past, past a new direction. You will see soon. Then whatever it is that at one point you thought looking in your past was broken, you will actually going to understand that no. The only thing that was broken is something that I did not need it. That's why it was broken. And moving forward by Three of Pentacles, you're ready to conquer new beginnings, new horizons. I also have here Page of Pentacles. This is a new beginning. Beginning that will be successful to you. 
that will bring you financial prosperity and stability. And once again, for the third time today, the strings car come up. It's a powerful, new, incredible, prosperous beginning. You will have no time looking back in the past. You will take that past as a batch. You know how soldiers get batches of honor? That's one big batch. Maybe people may not notice nor see physically that batch. But that batch is forever engraved in your soul. That is the batch you earned. So this is an incredible reading I have for you today, my wonderful collectives. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I did. Once again, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Stay safe. Be kind to one another. I'll see you next time. Bye.